but we do have to worry about the participle because there is a fairly common Puol participle. Tell me something about the Puol participle. Like the pit ale, it's going to have two things we saw in the pit ale. One is a? Preformative. All right, we got the preformative meme, right? In fact, that's not distinctive to the PL and Puol because you have it in the hip field. That's just kind of what participles tend to do. Now, let's, this could be P a hip field for all we know. Um, if we want to make it PL Puol, we're going to do two things. We're going to have a Dagish Forte in the middle letter, and we're going to have a schwa under the meme, just as we did in the pit ale. Remember, that's essentially the same pointing as we had in the imperfect with the schwa under the prefix. Now, what's going to make this distinctively Puol as opposed to pit ale? Guess what? Kibbutz. Got it? And here's the other trick, okay? We're going to get a comet here in the participle. Where else did we see a comet in the participle? In the nifal, okay? What do the nifal, uh, what does the nifal and the pu'al have in common? They're both functioning as passives, okay? And these conjugations that seem to function as the passive participles, you were going to see this also over here when we get to this box, uh, have a comets in the participle. So there's your all participle. That's it. This is one of the easiest conjugations, if you will, to learn because the kibbutz is pretty, first of all, you already kind of know the ropes because we've done pit ale. Secondly, the kibbutz is really striking. Greg. With the loss of the um, imperative, does that mean there's also no just as a coordinate in that or no? If it is, it's rare. I couldn't tell you off the top of my head whether there's a just of But you don't have to worry don't about it. it. In fact, you, if you think about it, you really don't have to worry about the justice of the cohortatives in terms of forming them because they're going to be formed the normal way, no matter what. Um, where are we going to have problems in the pool? There are some verbs that are going to be oh, irregular. Where do we where do we have problems in the uh, in the pit ale? With verbs that are second guttural, right? Remember that? Let's review. 